Good morning, Northwest Las Vegas. I'm David Carroll, your Las Vegas realtor with Signature Real Estate Group, and welcome to Estrella Park by Richmond American Homes. These are all single story luxury homes. We're located out here in the northwest of Las Vegas, right off of Ann Road, getting close to the I 215 here in the heart of the northwest. Currently 55 degrees. We're going to have a high of 65, nine mile an hour winds, and fall weather is here. Now, here at Estrella Park, they do have three floor plans to choose from. You have the Raven, the Rocco, and the Robert. All sitting on almost half acre home sites. Definitely enough room for some RV parking. And today we're going to be featuring the Rocco model. It's a four bedroom, three and a half bath with a three bay garage. Has the outdoor courtyard, approximately 3,470 square feet. Today's starting price starts at $969,950. Let's take a closer look. Now you will get all the paver stones included. We've got some eight foot garage doors. Now here on the side, traditionally you get like a 200 amp panel. I believe these are 400 for this size house. Need to double check on that. Also got solar on the roof, depending on which floor plan you'll, will determine the size of your panels. Got your outdoor irrigation, main hose line. We do have the upgraded eight foot doors and you will get three elevation choices on these. So bright on the stone. I do want to show you right around the side. So you got the homes are sitting on huge lots. So you definitely have room for RV parking on the side if you want to install a gate. And let's take a closer look. Got your aluminum gate here in the courtyard. I would probably add some type of shading here. Gorgeous coach lighting, modern windows with the black trim. As we come up on the porch, we have two LEDs. You have these two modern windows that don't open, two traditionals on the side. I just love this black trim. Gives it a great look. It's actually a really dark brown trim. And you have your eight foot front door. Let's head inside. Now, welcome to the Rocco. Here is your entryway. Flip it all the way around for you. So many options you can do on these homes. They are starting in that high 900s to the low 1 millions. We are seeing customers come in right about 1, 2, 1, 3 on these homes with options. Now some of the structural options you can do here on the Rocco, you can do the professional light kitchen or the professional kitchen. Fireplace number one, fireplace number two, or fireplace number three. You can do the wet bar at the dining room, the wine room, the pet spa, alternative laundry entrance. I hope we get to see that one. You got the owner's walk-in shower, owner's bath spa, Owner's bath spa with freestanding tub, extended cover patio, multi slides at the nook in the kitchen, multi slides at the great room, extended covered patios, owner's bedroom with French doors. Where do we start? Have a look at this kitchen. Oversized island, one, two, three, four, five bar stools. We are looking at a high level quartz with the waterfall edge. Large veining on this quartz. And if we slide over, here's our Marisink stainless steel undermount. Has a center divide, low threshold, upgraded hardware. Look at that. Also got your air gap here. And if we take a look down below, garbage disposal. And we are looking at soft clothes on these cabinets. This is your monogram dishwasher. I always wanted to check on the top. There's a lot of these high-end ones have this for your silverware on top. So cool. And look how bright this tub is. 
We're looking at vaulted ceilings with the beams, upgraded pendant lighting, and those are huge. Just looking at the lighting, we got four, eight, 12 lights over the kitchen, a four pack over the great room, and then two kind of in the middle dining area. We also got some stereo speakers because she's a model. And coming back around to the kitchen, we're looking at 42 inch upper cabinets with the stacked uppers with the glass doors. Got a large six inch modern crown on the top. Full overlay with the lip on the bottom. Look at these. It's a very dark gray. Large pools and does have the soft clothes. They have pulled the quartz slab all the way up, got under cabinet lighting as well. And this is storage for days. Here is your range. High end monogram double oven even got soft clothes on these drawers let's see i believe these do light up right behind as well this is a beautiful stove beautiful range we're looking at six burner with the griddle actually this is the four burner with the griddle and the broiler Wow, look at this monogram vent hood. These are my favorite here, the warmers. They really do put out quite a bit of heat. Executive chef style venting. Now these can get pretty loud, I'll turn it on for you. But it's all about cooking, right? The louder you know you're getting that airflow and you can definitely feel it. So these are quite a bit loud. And are we venting out? I can't even reach it up here. We sure are. Coming around this side, I do love the Accent modern windows on each side. Gives it a great energy. I'd love to see what it looks like with the lights off in here, but with these triple glass, actually with these four glass stacking sliders, 15 foot, letting in so much light. Now here's your built-in monogram oven, your built-in microwave, and these are huge. Don't worry, they're gonna give you a little message to remind you to take out the metal tray if you're microwaving. Got the butler's pantry right off the side. And access to the garage, currently locked. We are looking at eight foot interior doors with 10 foot ceiling, six panel. And where are those cookies? Beautifully upgraded cabinets in the pantry. Loving these metal baskets. What a cool idea. And it's this Closets of Las Vegas. They've been making their rounds for sure. I like this modern LED lighting as well. Very clean. So these are luxury single story homes. If you look off into the great room, we've got the electric fireplace, fan and light. I do want to mention here in this front dining room, you have options to do the optional cabinets, the wine room, the built-in bookcase, and there is an option for a slider, a sliding glass door that can give you access back here. Coffered ceilings, four LEDs, chandelier lighting, and have a look at the wine room. If you remember these models, they had them over at Scott's Pine in Summerlin. You also had Ravenwood in the Northwest. These are special single story homes. You're not gonna find these everywhere, that's for sure. Wow, floating shelves, wine for days. Now, before we take a look here in the rooms on the east side here of the wing, we are gonna take a quick peek back out back. They've upgraded to the 15 foot sliders and they are magnificent. Also got your optional covered patios installed, multiple LEDs with a fan. And welcome to Estrella Park by Richmond American Homes, luxury single story homes. 
currently we're looking at build time from dirt out here about seven to eight months. They do have a uh, three or four specs that should be ready here in the next 90 days or so. Total of 40 home sites. They've sold about 16 so far and uh, lot sizes are just under a half an acre. With that being said, lot premiums have been coming in around 50,000 estimated. And estimated customers are spending around that 1.2 to 1.3 million currently. All in with options. You can build from dirt if you like. They have some dirt lots available. And look at the footprint to the Rocco. These homes are sitting on some large home sites, I tell you that. And then look at this side yard. RV storage for days. HOA here is 109 a month, I believe. I will double check that. It is gated, no park, no SIDS or LIDS. What are you gonna do with this backyard? They put tons and tons of rocks out here. With a backyard like this, it, it will get pretty costly really quick. Now when you take ownership, it'll be all dirt here in the backyard, so this is what you're working with. They got the view fencing on the back of these models. So you do have access here right off of Ann Road. There's gonna be two gates, one on each side. They kind of chopped up the community just a little bit. Well, what do you guys think? I wanna take a quick peek at the air conditioning systems out here. Now, one thing I like about living in this Northwest area is you have really good access to the I-215. And I feel like anytime you're close to the I-215, it's great to get to work, get on that freeway quick. Got two high efficiency Goodman ACs. I want to take a look and see if we can see the sear rating on these. So we are looking at a 14 sear. Also 14 sear on this AC. Got your power outlet here on the side. Looks like we have a gas barbecue stub. And then they also get power uh, shutoffs for your AC. So when they're working on them, they can just shut those down. We're looking at a skip trawl stucco texture with the desert colors. And look at that patio cover built for entertainment. They've got the artificial turf, some concrete pads out here. I believe you do have an option to do a door here to the primary suite. And they've got the lattice work and the barbecue set up on this model. This is the bullet barbecue. So clean. Love that as well. Nice sitting area. Let me take a quick peek on this side. Nice run as well. Gate's pretty far up. Let's head back inside. What a home. The backyard alone just gets me. Now we're heading right in here in the back of the house in the rear. Here's the primary suite. The first thing I notice is the sheer volume. Five windows, coffered ceilings, four LEDs, and a pre-wire. And she has stereo speakers because she's a model. Room for sitting space. You also do get fire sprinklers in all these homes per code. I kind of like it with the window, but having door access is definitely great. I mean, you're really right next to the slider, so. Currently 55 degrees out here in Las Vegas, here in the Northwest, 10 mile an hour winds, 37 on the air quality. We're gonna have a sunset of 553. Every day it gets a little bit earlier. I can't wait for the fall, fall back time. It'll be getting dark though, about 5 p.m., so get those showings in early. Now here is the spa retreat. The one upgrade you have to do, zero threshold, all glass, tiled up. This one has the spa, bathtub, freestanding. I think I'm in love. I would totally use this. I haven't had a bathtub in a while, but I would totally use this all the time. 
gorgeous hardware as well. Get the three modern windows. We got a herringbone pattern going on in here. Those are some large windows as well. How is the view? Really nice drying bench. What do you got, like room for three, room for four there? Got the dual shower heads with the rain shower included. And that's just perfect. You can turn them both on, just kind of stand right here. Zero threshold. And here is your vanity. Got his and her vanities with the powder. Looking at one and a half inch on the quartz edge. And they have well, put the wallpaper on this one. Great design. Looks like a level four quartz, rectangle colors, Moen hardware, or is that Delta hardware? Delta hardware on that one. Love the powder extension. You got cabinetry for days in here. And is this soft closed as well? We are looking at beautiful dovetail construction, under mount rails, under mount glides, and it does have the soft close. And this is his side. Got his and her closets in here as well. And Closets of Las Vegas has been here. Got some modern lighting above. Also attic access from this closet. So good size, not too bad. And then right next door we have our water closet. And closet number two. This is hers. Upgraded carpeting on the floor. I like this. Now, if you're going to upgrade your closet, do it ASAP. Don't do it like I did. And I had a, had a model home, and I bought it back in 2011, right, when the prices had crashed. Anyway, they ripped out the whole closet. So I didn't upgrade my closet for a few years. Ended up selling the house right after I upgraded the closet. So I guess my point is, if you're going to upgrade that closet, do it ASAP. So that's our primary suite, our primary bath. If we flip it back around, you do have this little niche area with the lowers. It looks like they're doing some work to their fireplace. Beautiful tile work, though. Look at that. I don't think I've seen these tiles before. Very porcelain, shiny feel with some feels on it. You got your mantle, your TV hanging. Before we leave the kitchen, I wanted to show you this refrigerator. This is luxury. I can't remember the inches on it. Is it 80 inch? This is huge. This is monogram. Got the full built in. Look at those downstairs lowers for the freezer. This is like having two refrigerators in one. Absolutely. So you got your ice maker down below. Dual ice makers. So you got two refrigerators basically. And that one's still, just one side is larger than the refrigerator I have at home. Love the stacked upper, so clean, very tight on the seam. And those glass windows definitely pop. All right, now we're heading towards the secondary bedrooms. Here's our half bath for guests. Upgraded as well, tile on the walls, wallpaper. And what do we got back here? All right, more artwork. I thought we were gonna see a window. Let me show you on the floor. We're looking at a five inch baseboard, 12 by 24 tiles. And your upgraded toilet, comfort height, quartz tops, cooler under mount. And then right outside of the bath, we have our coat closet. So right off the entry, got quick access. Here is the office or the den. Also upgraded with the copper ceilings and four can lights. Now I believe this is the side where you can do the optional sliding glass door right off of the courtyard. They've also done the French doors. You have options to do double doors as well. Great little office space right on the entry. Three floor plans to choose from out here. Luxury single stories. Now here's bedroom number two. 
Having the 10 foot ceilings helps. They've also added the can lights and the fan. Definitely a go to for these homes. And this is a suite. Eight foot interior doors, 10 foot ceilings. Got the one large window here and the full bath attached. They have upgraded the shower. Those are some large tiles too. Those look like 16 by 30s or 16 by 32 at least. Gorgeous. Tile to the ceiling, modern window for days. Let me show you that window. Loving the built-in soap niche as well. Very nice. Two by twos on the floor. Nice thick glass. This is all luxury. And your vanity. One and a half inch on the edge. Kind of a, a pretty good sheen on that quartz. So that's the suite. Bedroom two. Got more storage, more linen. Here's our secondary bath. They have upgraded to the dual sinks, more of the quartz tops. This is more of your standard configuration on your tub and shower, but they've added the tile work as well and the modern window. I've been seeing this nickel package in a lot of the homes, the brush nickel. Definitely the blacks and the brush nickels are in currently. This is 2022 and here is bedroom number three. Nice energy in this room with this large window getting in this morning sunlight. Total of 40 home sites out there, sold about 16 so far. Got some specs, some quick move-ins coming in the next three months. About seven to eight month build time from dirt. And I feel like the builders are slowly, slowly starting to get caught up. It's strange some of the things that the builders have been getting backed up on. Like on one of our uh, clients' builds, there's delayed on the baseboard so they're having to hold off painting the house now here's bedroom number four what a great size i like this room feels so large with the 10 foot ceilings multiple offices setups in this home six panel interior doors eight foot Here is our washroom, 42 inch upper cabinets, five inch modern crown. They've got the sink in the lowers. Maris sink. Yep, there's our secondary bedrooms. One, two, three here on this wing. Washroom, got the office, and then the primary suite right in the rear. Well, what do you think guys? That's the Rocco model Estrella Park by Richmond American Homes. If you'd like any more information, give me a call anytime. And if you like the video, hit like, hit subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.